This is a big week for parents across western New York as kids all over the region head back to class for the start of the new school year. And right now, the push is on to improve reading for Buffalo Public School students. Now, there's been a sharp decline since the pandemic with students falling way behind on their studies, especially in reading. According to data from the State Department of Education, a little more than 24% of third graders in Buffalo schools were proficient in English language arts. That's down from more than 32% in 2018 and 2019. But the district is setting a new goal. By 2025, it wants every third grade student to be reading at proficiency levels. 7 News senior reporter Eileen Buckley shows us how a special new vending machine is helping one city school achieve that goal. Getting Buffalo school children excited about reading is the theme behind this book vending machine. Five years ago, the Arthur O. Eve School was the first to bring the machine into its school. But on Tuesday, students unwrapped an upgraded vending machine donated by Global Vending Group. Students put a token into the machine to receive a free book they can keep. Buffalo School Superintendent Dr. Tanja Williams says the school board wants her to focus on literacy. Our children must be able to read. Literacy, mathematics, and graduation rates increasing. The way that we get our children to learn and understand mathematics better is helping them to read better. My kids love reading and this school has definitely fostered that love of reading. Amy Cross Viola has two young children at the Arthur Eve School. Do you both like reading? Yes. This school does a really great job of getting students excited about reading. They have the principal's monthly reading challenge where if you read a certain number of books per month, you get to pick a book from the vending machine. But the school only has a proficiency rate of about 25%. But the problem that we see is when students have a difficult time comprehending. So that's the reason why our school district is moving to a structured literacy block to strike a balance with all the pieces that leads to a proficient reader. But Principal Nathaniel Barnes tells me last year reading levels bounced back a bit after COVID caused big setbacks. And the Buffalo School Superintendent says by the year 2025, they want all third graders to be reading at a proficiency level. Is it realistic to say by 2025 that number will change for the district? It's definitely realistic to say that that number will change. Um, we are hopeful that by 2025, all third graders are reading. Um, and with our new structured literacy block and the new curriculum that we've uh, adopted for grades three and beyond, I am confident that we will see that number increase. Dr. Williams tells me initiatives like the book Vending Machine generate excitement around reading and the district will be starting an extended learning time program earlier in the school year and will be adding a new reading program. We will this year be rolling out for all of our schools. Um, it's a scientific reading intervention, Orton-Gillingham, and we have seen tremendous gains in a really short period of time in the schools that we began rolling it out in last year. So teachers have been getting training all summer. The training will continue in the fall. But for now, a simple concept of a vending machine has student Victorious Brown Mayfield happy about reading. Because it just makes me like feel good that I can like really do it. Eileen Buckley, 7 News, Buffalo.